Hi everyone, it's Alex from Risk Academy and if you've seen my videos, especially my videos and my posts about risk management software, you know I don't usually get excited about software um, because 99% of the software packages that are available on the market are either completely useless or um, a total waste of time which is basically the same thing. Um, however, I am excited, I'm genuinely excited about good things that happen for the risk community. And one of the best things that happened in the last couple of months is that one of the risk modeling software, the software that we use to extend the functionality of Microsoft Project, Primavera or Excel, to extend the functionality to allow us to perform Monte Carlo simulations, one of those software packages became free. I mean, that is pretty amazing. And I wanted to, to share that news with you because I'm kind of surprised that not many not that many people picked up on that. But Model Risk by Vossi Software, uh, and just Google it, Model Risk, one word. Um, don't Google it in two words because Model Risk is basically risks associated with, uh, with modeling. That's a completely different thing. No, Model Risk is the name of the software. Um, and it's exactly the same as uh, um, Oracle Crystal Ball. It's exactly the same as uh, Palisade at risk in principle. It's exactly the same and in principle. So if you, you've been using these two packages that you would be you know, quite well familiar with the functionality that uh, model risk offers. The only difference is, I mean, and you know, I've been using Crystal Ball for one project. I had to. It's the worst possible software. I hate it so much, so passionately, it's the most useless software, completely not user-friendly, and there's a reason why Oracle kind of stopped supporting it. Um, we have been using Palisade for years until we've discovered major uh, programming issues with the interaction between Precision Tree and At Risk, and there's an article on our blog, on Risk Academy blog, showing how to fix that problem. And uh, at some stage we just got sick of it constantly crashing and taking ages to model. So we've now, for all the training, for all the consulting, for all the actual risk management work that we do with uh, my colleagues in the Institute of Strategic Risk Analysis and Risk Academy, um, we've switched to, to model risk because it has two obvious benefits. One, it is probably about 100 times faster. It has a different algorithm for performing scenarios, so it is much, much, much faster than uh, at risk of crystal ball. And the second one, it doesn't crash. And, and I mean, this is just, the, you have no idea how mind-blowing this is. Because there's nothing worse than setting up uh, the simulation, running it for 20 hours, going home, coming back to work, seeing that it's still running, and then coming back the next day to see it's completely crashed. And I mean, this just annoys the shit out of me. Um, so I am delighted to start testing and using model risk for whatever we do, uh, for whatever projects we do. It probably will have issues just like any other software package will, and we will uncover those and we will communicate with the developers and we will try to to give our feedback to help make the software better and more user-friendly. But at the moment, <laughs> I just ate a fly. I'm in Volgograd and there are a lot of flies here. Um, so anyway, at the moment, uh, we've started using it and it's a breath of fresh air. So I highly recommend, there's a link underneath, um, download the free version. It has limitations um, that will probably be you know, significant limitations for very, very professional users. But if you're just using it to model business plans, investment projects, if you're using it to model most kind of basic business decisions, it will be more than enough. I'm, 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 I'm actually kind of speechless uh, because to offer that software for free is an amazing, amazing opportunity that I wish most risk managers would take. There's really, today, there's absolutely no reason to not use the proper risk modeling tools because the tools are free, easy to use and available. Good luck. I'm interested in hearing your thoughts and see you in the next video. Don't forget to subscribe to the official Risk Academy channel on YouTube.